Image number one, the bottomless pit on the sun. This mesmerizing image captures the intense and intricate details of a sunspot in all its turbulent glory, snapped by the keen eyes at the New Jersey Institute of Technology's Big Bear Solar Observatory. A sunspot, which might playfully be mistaken for a digital abyss in a game of Minecraft, or the fiery gaze of a mythical creature, is a region on the sun's surface that is cooler than the areas around it, resulting in reduced brightness. The sunspot's darkness is a stark contrast to the fiery golden hues we typically associate with the sun. It's not that the sun has turned black. These spots are simply cooler and therefore less luminous than the rest of the solar surface. They're a visual symphony of the sun's complex magnetic activity and are essential to understanding the sun's impact on space weather and, consequently, our planet. The sun's dynamic nature is a reminder of the power and mystery of the star at the center of our solar system, constantly inviting us to learn more and gaze deeper into its cosmic beauty. Image number two, Mars face. This intriguing image from Mars is a testament to the human propensity for pattern recognition, known as pareidolia. Here, the natural landscape of Mars has randomly aligned to form what appears to be a face with pronounced features, evoking a sense of familiarity amidst the alien terrain. The interplay of light and shadow on the Martian surface has sculpted an illusion so vivid it captures the imagination and invites speculation about the model it might resemble. These formations are geological in nature, yet they whimsically mimic the human countenance, serving as a reminder of our innate desire to find reflections of ourselves in the universe around us. Image number three, the art of Mars. The image provides a captivating view that could easily stir the imagination into seeing a multitude of surreal visions. One might liken it to a scene from a dream where dozens of eyes adorned with mascara weep their darkened tears onto the vast canvas of a desert. Yet this is a vista not from Earth, but from Mars, showcasing the peculiar beauty of dark streaks of collapsed material running down sand dunes, a phenomenon caused by the evaporation of carbon dioxide frost. These Martian features, resembling the trails of tears from an array of weeping eyes, might seem to carry an emotional weight. One could whimsically suggest that perhaps Mars is expressing a longing, a yearning for the days when its rivers flowed and its atmosphere buzzed with the potential for life. Could it be that the red planet is mourning its past vibrancy, longing for the attention of distant humanity as we cast our gazes upon its surface from millions of miles away? Image number four, love from Mars. This captivating collage from Mars presents a delightful array of heart-shaped features, each one a natural formation etched onto the planet's surface by meteor impacts, wind erosion, or geological movements over countless eons. It's a whimsical nod to the earthly concept of Valentine's Day, seen in the most unlikely of places. The whimsy of spotting such tender symbols on a planet, known for its harsh and barren landscapes, offers a stark contrast to the stereotypical notion that Mars is rugged and Venus is gentle. Flipping the script on the old adage, men are from Mars, women are from Venus. In these images, Mars shows a softer side, inviting us to appreciate the universal language of love and beauty that even the cosmos seems to understand. While we recognize that these shapes are the work of natural forces, it doesn't stop us from marveling at their charming appearances and the serendipitous moments of joy they bring to those who find them amidst the vastness of space. Image number five, Martian Bigfoot. The image from NASA stirs the imagination, capturing what some whimsically claim to be the first official Bigfoot sighting on Mars. Located in the lower left corner behind the rocks, there's a curious shape that bears a coincidental resemblance to the legendary Earth creature. This snapshot provides a perfect example of pareidolia, where our minds are quick to spot familiar patterns in random shapes, even on Mars. Of course, the suggestion of an actual Bigfoot on Mars is more a playful thought than a serious hypothesis. It's human nature to jest, to let our thoughts leap to fantastical conclusions, and to prepare for interplanetary visitors with a humorous surrender, offering up not-so-perfectly baked cakes as peace offerings. It's all in good fun, Acknowledging the lighter side of space exploration and the way our brains are wired to find familiarity, 
even millions of miles from home. Image number six, Earth's auroras from space. Captured from a vantage point high above Earth, this image reveals the magnificent spectacle of the aurora borealis, or northern lights, as seen from space. This natural phenomenon, resembling a celestial dance of light, is far from the ectoplasmic manifestations of science fiction. It's the result of solar winds interacting with our planet's magnetic field and atmosphere, which when viewed without the distortion of the air below, unveils the auroras in all their ethereal glory. This view of the auroras from space provides a clearer, more expansive perspective, unfettered by the Earth's atmospheric interference. It allows us to witness the full majesty of these lights as they ribbon across the planet's pole, a truly breathtaking sight that underscores the beauty of our planet's interactions with the sun. Far from being supernatural, they are a spectacular reminder of the natural wonders our universe holds. Image number seven, Earth's abstract artwork. This striking image from above captures the Tanizruft Basin, a stark and desolate region of the Sahara Desert, known as the Land of Terror for its inhospitable terrain. From this orbital perspective, the basin transforms into a monochromatic canvas, reminiscent of abstract art. The interplay of light and shadow across this vast expanse weaves a complex pattern that could be likened to a cosmic artist melting hues of darkness and light. It is Earth's own brand of natural artistry, a display that can be fully appreciated only from the heights of space, revealing the unexpected beauty in an area renowned for its harshness. Image number eight, is that a moon? The celestial body in this image is Saturn's moon Mimas, and it's making a striking impression with its Herschel crater. This prominent feature gives Mimas a curious resemblance to the Death Star from the Star Wars franchise. While it may stir up memories of intergalactic battles and epic space sagas, rest assured, this is purely a natural satellite doing its cosmic rounds. It's a fascinating coincidence that Mimas wasn't known to have this distinctive crater until after the iconic Death Star made its debut in cinema. This timeline suggests that life was not imitating art, at least not in this case. The term solar terminator, which refers to the division between the light and dark sides of a celestial body, adds to the space lore with its science fiction-esque terminology, proving once again that sometimes reality can be as thrilling as the stories we conjure up. And with that cosmic tour, we wrap up our journey through the marvels of the universe. If you enjoyed this stellar exploration and our interplanetary discoveries, please show your support by hitting that like button, subscribing to our channel, and clicking on the video that has just appeared on your screen for more thrilling adventures across the cosmos. Until next time, keep your eyes to the skies and stay curious.